so I'm out on this beautiful day and I'm at a skiing resort at a place called Trisil. I'm, I'm not on the mountain that they use for the skiing, I'm actually going through the forest. So it's a little difficult to ski around here, but luckily there are some tracks around. I'm gonna see if I can find some great shots in here. The sun is out, it's beautiful. There's a few good things to be seen. I mean like getting these arching trees where the snow is kind of like weighing it down. It looks quite stunning. There's just, there's just snow everywhere. Um, it's minus 12 right now, but actually I'm quite warm, especially with skiing. Um, but it's, it's a great day and I believe I can find a really great shot. This absolutely stunning spot here. The sunlight is just coming through the trees here. There's a lot of like scattered out trees and it looks really beautiful. So I think I'm gonna take a shot from that angle there just where the sunlight is coming through. It just is really really nice. Okay, so this is where I'm going to take my shot. I've got the sunlight just coming through here and the, the trees are casting shadows, giving this really nice like beam, beams of light and I just think it looks absolutely stunning. So I'm actually thinking of doing a normal landscape shot, angling a little bit down so I get the foreground in and kind of get a little bit of the beams of the light. Um, but I'm gonna shoot this at around f18 just so I can get a sun star and also I'll get a lot of detail in the background as well um, I'm gonna shoot this at around 250th a second ISO 320 it looks absolutely stunning and I think it could make a really really nice shot found this absolutely stunning composition there's these trees that are just arched in there and it's actually quite clogged up with the trees behind it so they're just full of snow um, and I'm still getting a bit of sunlight coming through there but it actually is the clouds are starting to come back over now and it's starting to snow again um, but while I've got the good light I kind of just need to take these kind of shots Sorry for saying kinda all the time, I noticed I've been doing it pretty much in every video I do now but I kinda can't help it. <laughs> but anyway, um, that is the shot I'm gonna go for. One thing though, really hard to ski through the forest. As you can see my skis were just dug under the snow and if I take my skis off now I'll just drop through, it's really really deep. So yeah. Let me just take the shot. So you've got this one big tree here arching over and then you actually got three smaller ones behind it. And I actually like the composition behind. So I'm gonna aim for just shooting those ones and not get the bigger one in. It just has this really nice look and they're all at different, um, they're all different distances and it just gives us really nice depth to the image. So I think I'm gonna shoot this at one 250 of a second at 6.3 and ISO 160. I don't want to, I mean I can obviously pump up my aperture really high and add the detail everywhere and bring out the trees in the background and stuff but I kind of want to focus mainly on these three trees that are arched over. So I'm going to go quite low to the ground and shoot slightly upwards towards them just so I can kind of get the, the lower tree in the background through the one that's in the foreground. believe how beautiful it is here today oh my gosh um, it's really difficult skiing everywhere but wow what what stunning views and I found this amazing spot here the Sun is starting to go down and there's these like 
mounds of snow. It's absolutely stunning. And you got the sunlight just kissing the tops of them. Oh my gosh, this is, this is beautiful. This is kind of a shot that I was looking for. My composition is going to be between this little tree that's just sitting there and then this one that's kind of dead. It just gives us a really nice feel to it. Okay, so as I said, you're getting the sunlight just kissing the top of these little mounds that are here. It's, it's so beautiful. I'm, I just, I actually didn't think I would see something like this today. And as I said, the clouds are starting to come back over and it's a bit of snowflakes falling down. But, oh my gosh, it's just, it's just absolutely beautiful. Um, so I think I actually want quite a lot of detail out of this. The sun's not out enough to get a sun star now, so I don't have to put my Fs up too high now. But just to get enough detail, I'm going to put this at around F11, shooting at 250th of second and ISO 200. Um, I'm not entirely sure yet if I want to do it at a portrait angle or if I want to do landscape. But either way, I think this shot's going to be really beautiful. So let me just take this and we can have a look. What an awesome day it's been. It's been quite challenging for me though. Uh, I don't really ski, so going out by myself and skiing like this, especially through the forest, has been quite difficult, but I've managed. And I've gotten some quite stunning shots out of it as well. So I'm really happy I have come out. It's just the light out, of, the light out here is really stunning today. So yeah, I'm, I'm super happy with what I've gotten. So yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment below and let me know what you think because this one was quite different and really enjoyable And if you're new to the channel subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video